It is a gorgeous Sunday afternoon in the city of Monroe, Louisiana. We are currently pacing with Kansas City Southern's daily MARSH on Millhaven Road as the engineer of the westbound begins to ease up on the throttle. Dispatch has ordered the crew of the marsh to diverge into the siding for the hotshot intermodal from California ZLCAI. The Cali to Atlanta stack is currently sitting on the main line awaiting for our train here to clear off the main before continuing eastward. In today's short video, we'll be observing the marsh's typical duties in Monroe. This manifest has become somewhat of a monster in the last few months. This train has been constantly over 10,000 feet in length, which may be pretty average for other lines, but certainly not the speedway. Originating in Artesian, Mississippi, marsh switches multiple locations in Mississippi, such as High Oak Yard in Jackson, along with the small yard here in Monroe. This has been the cause for the increase in lengths of these freights. Leading the charge is a one-unit wonder in the form of GE ES44 AC 4869. It used to be a very common sight to see a single locomotive on the point of the marsh, but as of late, it has been more common to see four to six locomotives leading it. The marsh often serves as the train to transport power from the east, including six-axle road power or the humble four-axle jeep locomotives used for yard ops or locals. We see 4869 easing into the Monroe Yard. The marsh was given orders to drop off a handful of cars and to also pick up 45 pieces of rolling stock.
moved on to downtown Monroe. 4869 is making one final switching move before heading out. And just like that, the Monroe Yard has been served and the MARSH has a go-ahead to advance to Shreveport.